Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for November 26th of 2024 is titled The Sombrero Galaxy from Webb and Hubble. So what do we see here? Well, here we see two images of what is known as the Sombrero Galaxy, also known by a catalog designation of M104. And this is an example of a spiral galaxy and one of the larger galaxies in a nearby cluster of galaxies known as the Virgo Cluster. Now we see that here and we see two very different images when we look at it. The typical one that we're used to seeing is the Hubble image down below that is taken in visible light which shows the very distinct pattern of we can see the dust there the dust lane a dark dust lane going through it which kind of splits it up. Now that's typical of a spiral type galaxy. They have gas and dust within them and the dust is blocking out a lot of the light. So you will tend to see that dust. Now the dust doesn't give off visible light because it is much cooler than a star. Stars at several thousand degrees will give off visible light because of their high temperatures. Dust on the other hand might only be a few hundred degrees in temperature and that means it only gives off infrared light. And I should qualify that temperatures there in astronomy are given on the Kelvin scale, which starts at absolute zero. So the freezing point of water would be about 273 degrees. So when I say only a few hundred degrees, we're talking relatively cool temperatures here. And that would be what we would see in the infrared, which is in the top image, and that is the Webb Space Telescope image, which shows it in the infrared. Now you'll see that same dust lane that we see in dark on the Hubble image is actually bright. It is the dust that is giving off most of the light in this case. So the dust radiating at cooler temperatures, longer wavelengths will be prominent in the infrared, whereas in the visible light, it doesn't give off very much energy at all. So here we can see that distinct dust ring around the central portions of the Sombrero galaxy. And it's one of the reasons astronomers do like to study things at different wavelengths. It gives a different perspective on what we're seeing here. So it gives us a different perspective on the structure of the galaxy and allows us to see things that would otherwise not be seen. As you note here, we can see that dust lane all the way around in the web image because you're not seeing a lot of the starlight stars not emitting a lot of light in the infrared. That's not where they're prominent. And we see then we don't see that whole thing in the Hubble image. It's part of it is hidden by the excess light of the stars. So we can often get a completely different picture and a completely better a different understanding of objects by looking at them in different wavelengths. And here we see the visible visible light image from Hubble and the web image showing the infrared light of the Sombrero galaxy. So that was our picture of the day for November 26th of 2024. It was titled the Sombrero galaxy from Webb and Hubble. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Meteor Races Comet. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.